Kling AI is now in free pick. This is amazing. But this video is more than just Kling and free pick. I also have an amazing prompt generator for you to use. And these updates continue to take free pick to a new level. With this prompt generator, you'll be able to create the most amazing and detailed prompts specifically created for AI videos. It includes highly detailed scene descriptions, cameras, lenses, movements, and much more. Okay, so here we are in free pick. And just like that, Kling is going to be over here on the left hand side. And now right over here underneath mode, we have Luma Dream Machine, but click that and expand it. And now here is Kling. Now we have both 1.5 Pro and 1.5 Standard. So what we'll do is let's just first start with a basic prompt, text to AI video. But then after that, I want to go ahead and show you this amazing prompt generator. The one that I specifically created for these specific scenarios in creating the most realistic and cinematic AI video generations. So let me first show you some very good examples I already created in free pick. Now I'm over here in my mega prompts database. Check the links in the description. As I expand these images right here, I want to show you how good of a job it did in making this image an AI video. These have been some of the most impressive videos I've seen to date with Kling in free pick. Look how good of a job this did. I couldn't be more impressed. The realism and the way the camera moves, amazing job. And so here we are. Now we're over here in Kling. This was done using an image to video prompt. And in my opinion, that does does a little bit of a better job but I took this same exact prompt and I also pasted it into free pick and now here it is right here cling in free pick this did an amazing job but perhaps the most impressive one is gonna be this Sonic the Hedgehog one right here but look here is the full image created in free pick now the image is fantastic but how good of a job can this translate into producing a video. That is a phenomenal job. This has done a great job so far with all of these videos. Okay, so that was just a quick example on how good of a job that these can do. But now let's take things up a notch. I wanna show you this amazing prompt generator. In fact, I'm gonna show you not one, but three. But first you may be asking yourself, what exactly is a prompt generator? Well, simple, a prompt generator acts as a prompt engineer. It's a prompt that's gonna generate prompts. Prompts after prompts based off of any subject that you want or need. Need. So for an example, if I come over here into my prompt generators database and I'll specifically go to the AI video ones. Now the first one I want to show you is going to be this one right here. Okay. So the first thing you'll do is just simply copy and paste this whole entire prompt. And then you are going to visit your favorite LLM. In this case, we're going to head to chat GPT and then paste this full prompt in. So here we are. Let's go ahead and paste this whole entire thing in and now hit enter. Now what chat GPT is going to ask you is what is your subject going to be? It's going to automatically provide you with a default subject. If you don't like it, you can just provide a different subject. So let's go ahead and do that. At the very bottom, I'll just say this. It really is this simple. I just put a supercar driving, okay? Now, just like that, we're gonna get some prompts that are gonna make some amazing cinematic and realistic style AI videos. And the key thing to keep in mind here, the reason why this is gonna succeed so much in that is because in the actual prompt generator, it specifies exactly what it needs to focus on, okay? So we have photorealistic textures, including the lighting, but then it also states to specify a high-end cinema camera like this Ari Alexa and Red Epic, including some different lenses and also some moods and stylistic references. When it's all said and done, the end prompt is going to be this right here. This is amazing. So if you like it, go ahead and copy the whole entire thing. Now, the next thing you can do is what I would recommend is going to be one of two things. You can go ahead and then just paste the prompt in to free pick directly. And then you don't have to use any image references. We're going to make sure we have cling selected. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and select pro. And as my effects, we have all of our different options. I'll go with static and let's go ahead and generate this one. However, the more ideal situation would be the use free pick and first generate the image. Once you get an image that you like, I would suggest then taking that image and then converting that image into a cling video. And that's exactly what I did in these videos right here. You could see how amazing of a job these did. Let me go ahead and share more of these AI prop generators with you. The next one I want to show you is going to be this one right here. Again, we're going to come in here and then copy the whole entire thing. Now, remember, all of these databases are available for you via the links in the description. However, these prompts I'm sharing 
hearing today, I will also put on my website in my blog for everyone to use and try for themselves 100% completely free. Every prompt I'm sharing in any YouTube video will always be accessible completely for free directly on my website and blog posts. Let's go back to chat GPT and now start a brand new chat. And now I'm going to paste this one in. Okay. Just like that. Now at the very bottom, watch what chat GPT does. It's going to automatically break everything down for you. And it's going to create different subjects, different motions and different scenes. Then when it's all said and done, it's finally going to provide you with an amazing prompt that you can use that will generate some amazing AI videos. Okay. So this may take a little bit of a time because it really is served to give you every detail imaginable. So while that one's thinking, let's go back to my database one more time, because remember, like I said, I don't have just one prompt generator. I have three, and that is going to be this one right over here. Okay. It first defines the task, and then it's going to go ahead and pre-populate with these predefined styles. Now, my favorite portion of this is going to be number six and seven, because it's going to give you specific cinematographers and directors to use, including the extremely high quality award-winning movie camera lenses and specific cameras to use in these prompts. We're going to head back to chat GPT, and then this goes to work right away. And so while that one is generating, let's go back to the one I just showed you earlier. Remember, this took a little bit of a time, but as we come down right here, here is the final prompt that we could use. Let's generate the image first, because not only will these prompt generators work so well for just video, they're going to work amazingly well for AI images too. So that is the second one. And then let's go back to the first one that I just pasted in. Let's begin. Please provide the subject. So what should my subject be? And then there we go at the very bottom. And I'll just say a 3D render of Sonic the Hedgehog. So let's copy this one and then go back to free pick and now create an image based off of that one. But before we do, let's go ahead and look at the images we got for our cyberpunk woman. And look at this. This is fantastic. And then here is the second one right here. Let's see if I can convert this to video now and hit generate. But I did notice that over here now, this one was successfully generated and this one was done in Kling 1.5. So let's hit that play button. And wow, look at that amazing thing. That's the supercar going through the modern city. And that was created from my prompt generator. Amazing job. Our images are done. That is phenomenal. That was created. That's just the AI image from that prompt generator. Both of these look fantastic. And look at that one. That would be phenomenal. I bet that would do so well in a video. Now, remember, this was just a prompt by itself. I should have incorporated Sonic the Hedgehog. It just had hedgehog in it. So to be honest with you, it did its job. That is just a blue hedgehog. So my fault for the prompt, not actually saying Sonic, but again, it is pretty amazing. So there you have it. Another amazing update for free pick Kling AI now in free pick. And remember, link Links in the description to get access to all the prompts I share today, in addition to any prompt database. If you like this video, please hit that subscribe button and thank you so much for watching.